That's Nathan McKinnon, who's over on the far side, <laughs> and right with and right with him is Austin Watson. That is Austin Watson, man. So big ask, but you can't, you can't beat up the ice by McKinnon. So here's the thing. If you want to play that strong system, it's really tough against a team like Colorado. So watch what happens if you roll it up. Your Shabbat falls down, and then right there, those two guys beat both their forwards up the ice. So yes, Shabbat falls down, but to throw gasoline on that, both of your forwards get beat up the ice, and they turn a mistake into multiple mistakes. And that's when you look at plays like that, there's sometimes more than meets the eye. Shabbat falls, but two four checks got a little bit, two forwards got a little overzealous on the play. And uh, yeah. Zub ends up having to play a three on one. So anything to add there, Bobby? Yeah. I mean, when you look at the beginning of the clip, Broussard does everything right by finishing the check, but the, the biggest part about finishing a check is reloading. So he doesn't reload. Um, Watson goes for a skate. Like for me, if I'm seeing McKinnon here, I'm just backing up and making a business decision, right? Like, where are you going? <laughs> uh, and, and then on top of that, this, this play gets broken, but he over back checks as well. Uh, Watson does yeah. as opposed to just coming back and kind of, you know, shutting down at the, at the face off, um, at the hash marks there, like come back, shut down and then reattack. And I think that goal is prevented if he does that, um, at least the broken part of the play. Like Chabby's doing a good job here. Actually, he falls. That's going to happen. But he's but he's closing gap, and that's what you want to do against a guy like Nico Rantanen or a guy like McKinnon. Like as a defenseman, you want to close the gap. So, you know, I don't know why he takes a beating. He falls. It happens. But everybody else in this clip does nothing to alleviate. Like they just compound the problem. Zub screening his goalie, um, and yeah. the other two guys. Get, you know, Kasselik's the only one off the hook here because he finishes a check and, and doesn't have to worry about his guy. But other than that, every single guy in this clip is is has done something wrong right here. Like Zub would have, Zub would have closed that gap, but because he's seeing Gerard on the side there, you know, streaking down with nobody on him, he can't do anything. He has to just cave to yeah. the middle of the ice like he does. Yeah. So, you know, the biggest issue is if you get beat up the ice, you're putting a lot of pressure on your defenseman. 